previously on Fashion Wars. Um, hi, I'm Lizzie. I am a true fashionista. I, I, I will win. I'm just amazing like that. Hello, my name is Prince Andromeda. I came here to prove to my family that I am a good fashionista. I think I am the best person in this competition. Hi, my name is Mia. I have always loved fashion and I think I'm definitely the most fashionable person in this show. Are you willing to do whatever it takes to win this competition, including sabotaging other teams? Yes. Definitely. Yes, I am not here to make friends. I am here to win. Although I do have some strong competition. Not. <gasps> Like, what is Mia's deal? Does she have to be that, like, rude? I said what I said. Hey, watch what who you're talking to. <laughs> I wasn't even talking to you. Okay, it is time to spin the wheel of sabotage. And it's Lizzie. That would be cool. Did you just spill your smoothie all over me? How dare you? What the? Get out of my tent. Oh, my. Ugh. I don't like your nose. At least I have a face. Oh, she just said she wasn't hot. Oh, hi. <laughs> Sabotage? <gasps> I can't wear shoes. How dare you? I cannot believe that she did that. So when I sabotaged Mia, there was, there was a spark of joy that went through me. I can tell that you spent all your effort into this purple grape blob. Weird lollipop jelly. Thing in <laughs> to have fun being the best friends or whatever, but just remember that you're gonna have to go against each other at some point. We could have had a nice civil show, but if they want to start drama, then that's just how it's gonna be. <sighs> Time for- Hello? What are you guys doing in my tent? How did you even open it? What are you talking about? This is my tent. You're the weird I was weird. sleeping here like two seconds ago. Yeah, you snuck in the middle of the night. I was just sleeping here peacefully. Can we gone. not do this whole tent thing again? You may have fooled me last time, but you're not fooling me this time. What? Uh, fooling you? You seriously copied my teddy bear friend. Uh, yeah. I've had this teddy bear since I was like five, so uh... I've had it since I was four and a half. Well, I didn't even know you existed when I was five, I have, so... Yeah, I've had this this teddy bear. That's <laughs> not a teddy bear, that's a present. It, no, it's a teddy bear. It's just a very valuable teddy bear. It's worth like 50,000 bucks, so that's why uh, I have to keep it in the box. Sure. And I've had this one since I was two and a half. Okay. Yeah. Um, whatever. I can, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna have some breakfast. You guys can... Do whatever weirdos do with each other. Hey, you're the only weirdo here. Yeah, girl. right. Um, I'm pretty sure I won, so we'll just have to, like, see, but I'm pretty sure I did. Well, that's because it's your channel and your fans are unfair. What do you mean this is my channel? What channel? <laughs> I'm gonna go down and have a little snack. Hmm. <gasps> She's stealing my idea of having- What? Of, of having- Snap. I said this she, before. She's stealing all my popsicles and grapes. Anyway, I'm on a diet, so I'm just gonna have some frozen grapes instead <gasps> of the popsicle. Yo, I was holding the grapes first. She's oh my gosh! Me. Could you stop following me around? Oh, it's no, kind of no. pathetic. No. I just ate my my my, my teddy bear. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, could you stop following me around? It's like kind of pathetic. I know you really want to be like me, but like this is like. Sad. No, you're the more you're sad. Like you. You're like <laughs> sad as a old bad. Okay. <sighs> Whatever. I'm just gonna ignore you guys and come over here and enjoy my grapes. Okay. Could you not, please? <laughs> Why do the other contestants on this show have to be so annoying? Hey, you were the one who was annoying last time. Yeah, person. I didn't even say anything. Yeah, you did. You were judging our outfits. You were saying, oh, you look like a stinky potato. Yeah, I never said that. You were the one that was being all weird and calling my dress like a grape or something. Like, you need to work on your insults, buddy. Well, right now, you look like 
uh, strawberry pop tart. Uh, okay, I don't see. I don't think. I don't see how that's an insult, but uh. You look like a, a moldy strawberry pop tart. Okay, well, I, I don't. I'm not even. I'm not even. Oh, <laughs> uh, what are you doing? What, what do you mean? What am I doing? You're on fire. What? No, I'm not. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Can Noah and Lizzie be any more annoying? Like, all I did was criticize them, like, once, which, like, if they're real fashionistas, then they have to be okay with criticism. And then they just started teaming up together and having ganging up on me this, like, whole time. And they're just so annoying. They've been following me around, and ugh, I can't stand them. Mia always, like, gets mad at us from for messing around with her, when in reality, she was the one who started this. You know, Mia, I thought we were gonna be, like, great friends, because when you first walked in, I thought you were so pretty and stuff, but then you started being really rude, and that made me feel really upset. Like, that's just kind of rude. Good morning, contestants! We are soon going to reveal who won the last episode, so why don't- <laughs> Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> As I was saying, why don't you guys go get ready and come on to the stage so we can reveal the results. Okay, time to get ready. Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Fashion Wars! How are you contestants doing on this lovely morning? I'm doing great, thank you. I'm ready to win and destroy Mia. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we'll see about that. Okay, well, it is time to see who won the last episode of Fashion Wars, and who will get an extra minute of dress-up time this episode. Drum roll, please. So, the person who won round number one with 73.5% is... Mia! Oh, yes. Why? Why, Mia? <gasps> Yay! And the person who won round number two with 58.8% is... Lizzie! Yay! Never mind, this is <laughs> And last but not least, the person who won round number three with 43.5% is... Mia! Ha! Yes! I knew I was gonna win! Stop rubbing it in our faces! <laughs> Boom! Don't touch me! Oh, oh. <laughs> what are you doing, you weirdo? Oh. Okay, that's that's enough, Noah. And wait, 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 hold on, hold on. She's grown like a foot since the last time we saw her. I it's think my heels? She's trying to hide how short she truly is. It's my heels. To make, to make her outfits look better, she made herself <sighs> taller. Whatever. Haha, -ha, take that. So, Mia, this episode you will get an extra minute of time to dress up. Which I think will really help you. Don't you think so? Yes, thank you so much, all of my loyal followers. I knew I was going to win. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> you smell. <laughs> Is that the best you could do? Uh, Your face looks like a rotten, sour lemon that you just sucked on. <laughs> that makes no sense. <laughs> it looks like you just sucked on a, a rotten, smelly lemon. Okay, whatever. And your outfit looks like, like, a black cherry. I don't see how that's a bad Actually, thing. it looks like black licorice. Okay. Black, smelly <laughs> licorice. <laughs> I don't know what your weird obsession with the world, with the word smelly is, but, okay, uh. hold on, hold on, I have one. <laughs> you look like, you look like, um, like, it, uh, you look like magma. Magma? <laughs> yes, you look like magma. Magma turns into lava, and lava forms the earth, so that's not really an insult, it's more of a compliment. <laughs> yeah. Well, magma doesn't look pretty, so that's, that's, well, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, um, yeah, well, uh, you're trying, at least. <gasps> okay, well... <gasps> what the heck? <laughs> you're so weird! <laughs> Okay, anyway, since it is spooky season, we're going to have a special spooky-themed episode today. Um, so I thought that we could go somewhere that's 
fits the mood better. Come with me, guys. Oh, okay. What are you even talking about? Okay, whatever. Um, I'm excited to see where we're gonna go. I hope we go somewhere cool. Why are you talking like that? I don't know where we're going already. <laughs> Whoa! Look at this place! This is awesome! Super spooky! It's so spooky! Where are you guys going? Leaving. <laughs> Ride <laughs> around. <laughs> ah, you ran me over! Wow! This is so cool! There's apple bobbing and everything. Wow! <laughs> you sound very enthusiastic. Alright, why don't you guys stand near the fountain? We will reveal the first theme. Alright, it is time to reveal. The first theme, the theme for round number one is, drumroll please, Witch Slash Wizard. Ooh. Boo. Okay, I have some pretty good ideas for this. So, for Lizzie and Noah, you will have five minutes to create an outfit. Um, for Mia, you will have six minutes to create an outfit. And your time starts now. Okay, so I have an extra minute of time, which I think is really going to help me. So, the theme is witch slash wizard. So, obviously, I'm going to go for a witch. So, my outfit. Um, I don't really know what I want to do. I might do something similar to my Halloween costume, because why not? Okay, so, I'm probably going to do an evil wizard. Okay, so I got to do that. No, why? 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 Hmm. Uh, I think I'll come back to the face later. So, um, I could use a corset, probably. I think I'm gonna go for, like, a classic witch. I could go for this corset that I was wearing before. Hmm, let's maybe do purple or green. Let's do green. Green's pretty. So, looking through my accessories and stuff, I'm just gonna go to Halloween. I don't have much, but, um, ooh, I'm thinking the... A cauldron. I, I feel like that kind of says witch. I'm thinking these better earrings because why not? So I gotta go find an outfit that looks interesting, kind of like a wizard, I guess. You know, I might just go for the old, old outfit that I use for my standard outfit. And now let's get a nice skirt. So I could do the matching one or I can do something different. I think this is gonna be pretty easy. Well, let's try out this skirt if I can maybe remove the bow. That's cute. I can do that. I don't want to have all of these accessories because that can be a bit much. So I'm just going to go with the hat because the hat's kind of cute. It's like kind of basic. Go, 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 go. Oh no, I'm running out of time. How much time do I have? Three minutes and nine seconds. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Why are there so many outfits? And then let's get some boots. Maybe these. Yeah, we can do those. Okay, for my shoes. I don't have any Halloween shoes. <laughs> I'm thinking deer dollar heels because why not? They're kind of cute. I want to see if there's any green Halloween designs, because I feel like everything's just going to be like, oh, I like that. So I don't know how I feel about that. That looks like eyes. Um, <laughs> okay, yeah, that'll work. Okay, how about I go black? Oh, no, I have to scroll all the way down. Oh, no, I this is a bad move by me. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no, okay. Whew, it's right here, it's right here. Now, let's get a witch hat. So I have this one, but I might do... So I could either do the smaller one, or I could do this one. So then, for my skirt, um, I'm thinking like the kimono skirt, because it's kind of longer. But I feel like this is kind of good so far. My girl, this. Maybe add a scar across my face. I guess I'll do. Okay, 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 okay. How much time? Oh gosh, two minutes! No, 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 no! Oh no, 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 no. Let me try to- let me choose a hairstyle first. Ooh, this is pretty. I might go for this. So, I could go for this, or I could go for the other one, which is smaller. Hmm. I'll go for the big one. Okay, so then I need a corset. Which one kind of says, like, again, I don't really have any Halloween stuff. Uh, this one? Yeah, that one That one kind of speaks Halloween. I mean, n not really, but I could make it. <laughs> oh, yeah, gotta get the wizard stuff. I might actually add the bandana back. Now, I could either go for the broomstick or the staff. I don't think I can do both because I'm pretty sure they're in the same- Oh, they're not in the same hand. So I could do both, but I don't know if that'd be too much. Now, is this too much? Yeah, it kind of is. I'm going to get rid of the staff because this is kind of an exclusive broomstick that only some people have. 
true story. Um, so I'm gonna go for it. Her hair? Um, ooh, I could add some bangs. I don't know if this, this really speaks evil. Now, um, let me choose a nice witchy face. I could go for this gothic one like I was wearing before. How much time? One minute! Okay. <laughs> Actually, that's still count. That's still time. I might add these. Or, no, 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 not that. Um, the mask. Yeah, that looks good. I think I'll just go for this face now. Is there anything else I can add? Maybe some sleeves? A lot of face. I don't really like using faces, but... Oh my gosh, that looks so scary. That reminds me of, like, a dark Christmas. <laughs> okay. Perhaps a cauldron? Nah. Ooh, wait, you know what? Um, I wanna put my gloves on, because I feel like those are... Those kind of speed home It's kind of the same outfit I was wearing. Don't know if that's against the rules or not. Oh, I'm, I'm out of time. I'm out of time. Well, I don't know if there's anything I can do in the last few seconds. Maybe I can add just a little. You know, I think I might be done. Okay. And I'm out of time. Okay, time is up, and it is time to see our contestants' outfits. Please welcome our first contestant, Noah! What are you wearing today, Noah? An outfit. Uh, okay! I'm joking, I'm joking, y'all. We need to have a sense of humor. <laughs> What's a hermer? <laughs> you need to have a sense of humor, peep seal. I am wearing uh this like nice old uh 16th century uh sorry 18th century <laughs> um uh uh suit with its like little fluffy thing. Um hmm. and uh I also have a hook cuz I'm like an evil one and I lost my hand in battle. In the great battle of, and, uh, yes, eighteen twelve. Um, and I, uh, I have a hat because I'm a wizard. You can't be a wizard without a wizard hat. And it's glowing red because I'm evil. And oh. then I have an eye patch because it got cut out in the battle of eighteen twelve. <laughs> and then I have a scar because that happened in eighteen twelve. And then I wear a bandana because I'm being like inconspicuous, like no one knows who I am. <laughs> and then I have a staff, because that gives me all my power. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Noah. Please step off the stage so we can um, call on our next contestant. Uh, next up is Lizzie! So, uh, explain your outfit to us, Lizzie. Well, um, I just thought, like, the cauldron. I feel like every witch has to have a cauldron. And then the hook. Well, I lost my hand in the, um, war of 1812. Um, <laughs> it's a really rough war. Um, and then the stage manager, um, he gave me a hat backstage. So, so yeah, that's, that's why I have the hat. Oh, yes. Um, since Lizzie did not own a hat, and we thought it would be a little unfair because people not, m might not vote for her because of it, we decided to gift her a hat, so, Yeah. <laughs> Uh, thank you very much, Lizzie. Please step off the stage so we can, um, call on our next contestant. Okay, now, last but certainly not least, Mia! Hi, everyone! So, for this outfit, I went for a classic witchy look. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> no, you, this is the way you're, like, fleeing your boom around. I decided to go for a, um green color palette, which I think apple. it- <laughs> uh, Noah, please be quiet while she is explaining her outfit. I decided to go for a green color palette instead of purple, because I just thought it looked very cool, I guess. I decided to go for my exclusive broomstick that only some people have. True story. <laughs> it actually is. You're bragger. You bragger. I decided to go for this classic witch hat as well, with the bright green, um, rim. And, uh, yeah, that is my outfit, thank you very much. Um, could you not, please? Ugh, so immature. No, you're immature. <laughs> you're the one- the pe the fact that you say, oh, that's immature, that makes you immature, bro. That- okay. And the fact that you don't fight back, that makes you a chicken. What? <laughs> fight- what do you- what? We're not fighting. You're a chicken. Chicken, <laughs> chicken, bok, 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 bok. You are so <laughs> weird.
Okay, thank you everyone. It is some tough competition today. Indeed it is, my friend. I think the best outfit here is clearly by Noah. But that's totally that is... not me being biased. That is very insulting for you to try to mimic my voice, um, and you will be demoted because of that. Just kidding. So, now it is time for the viewers to cast their votes. You can go in the pinned comment below and vote for who you think won round number one. Please vote based on whose outfit you like the most, and not because of whoever you just like better because of their personality or, um, you know, their videos. Uh, so, um, that we can have a, um, fair game. So, uh, yeah. Before we move on to round number two, it is time for a, uh, intermission. Can I get in? Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are so weird. I'm just gonna go get some apples. <sighs> time to do some apple bobbing, which is super fun. One of my favorite fall activities. Ah, first try. I'm just so amazing. Um, oh, hi. What are you guys even doing? What are you doing here? I'm yeah. apple bobbing, this is obviously. This apple bobbing stand. You can't claim an apple bobbing stand. The show gifted well, we us this. Did. Yeah. No, it didn't. It did, because we have way better outfits than you. Yeah, sure. Um, remember who won? Yeah, but it was a close second. And I think... <laughs> Lizzie had a close second. You didn't. <laughs> yeah, because people don't know what fashion is. And... Wow, are you insulting your... Best friend? No, 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 no. What I mean by that is they voted for you instead <laughs> of me. And also, uh, I think you also gave, uh, 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 pay for bots for them to vote for you. And that's how you Are won. you trying to answer conspiracies now? No, I'm just spreading <laughs> the truth. Yeah, sure. Um, anyway, are you guys still, like, being all friendly with each other because, you know, this is a competition, right? And you can't just gang up on someone. Oh, sure we can. Watch some other reality shows. Like, the great running first place game. <laughs> I've never heard of that. And also, um, we there are only three contestants here. So you really can't just, like, you know, you team up with someone. You can't say what we can't do. I mean... I can. I can't control you, but I can make suggestions. That is not true. I just know that this little alliance or whatever is gonna break at some point, and you guys are gonna no, all go all that's not true, no against. No one ever gets eliminated, so we'll yeah. always be here. But what's gonna yeah, happen no. when it when it's a close tie and one of you ends up winning? I bet you guys are gonna take it out on each other. Nah, and we'll yeah. be celebrating. We'll go get some uh food and celebrate. Without you, obviously. Yeah, sure. I know that this little line's gonna break at some point, so... Well, you can think all you want, but it will never break. When, when Mia said that, I was, like, so mad. Because, like, we're actually... We're not just, like, game friends. We're actually friends, and we actually get along. No competition could ever break us apart. When Mia said that we weren't gonna be friends anymore, I was so upset. We're gonna be besties forever. You know, one day... We might actually get married. I said what I said, and I meant what I said. They might be all friendly now, but when it comes down to it, they're gonna have to sabotage each other at some point. And, uh, let's just say you won't want to be around when that happens. Anyways, I'm gonna go get some candy so you guys can go do whatever losers do. Is that supposed to be a ghost impression? What? What are you talking about? I'm just... I'm here. <laughs> You're so weird. Apples. Oh, I finally got away from them. I'm just gonna ring some doorbells and get some candy. Hi, trick or treat. I hope you get a chat. Oh, excuse me. How did? How are you even talking? I'm like several feet away from you. Oh. <laughs> Maybe you're just weird and you have really good hearing. Yeah. How is that weird? Totally weirdo. That's a yeah, good thing. Super weird. Can you put a disclaimer that I'm just making a joke and people who have really sensitive hearing, like that's awesome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to. How have did you? Oh food. my gosh! Can you stop following me, please? What? No, you're following me. I was, I was here first. No, no, no. 
Oh no, I was here first. Oh my gosh, we were I'm going first. to the other neighborhood. Hey, look at me flying on my broomstick. Yeah, 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 like a tall loser. You know, br broom flying is old. That's like a century old. A century? I'm yeah, using a staff to fly. That is new and hip. People don't fly on staffs. No, they don't fly on staff. <laughs> they use a flap, a, a flap, a staff a flap. to levitate themselves into the air. Yeah, sure. Is these cans? <laughs> I don't know where the cans are. I don't know what and the candy that was, is. That was purposely bad grammar. Mm -hmm. Sure. Yeah. Okay, contestants. I hope you enjoyed your little break. Now it is time to gather around. Um. This uh, is me. This is just a ghost. Okay, uh, well, um, it is time to gather around at the fountain so we can talk about the next round. You cheater, you have fly speed. How, is I, how am I cheating? This competition cheater. isn't about flying. Cheater, cheater alert, cheater. How am I cheating? Flying has nothing cheater. to do with fashion. Cheater, because she can fly away fast without us noticing and then change her outfit without us noticing. Uh, no, 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 please, please, please. Ah, I mean, she is. Ah. No, stop, stop, stop. Ah! No, I'm too young to die. <laughs> Where are I'm you? Oof. Did oh, you no. die? Yeah. I wish I saw that. I was too far away. But we did catch the audio on camera. And I escaped, so. <laughs> when I almost got killed while trick or treating, that was so abusive. I could have sued. Like, just look at me. I'm so cute. Why would anyone ever want to try to kill me? Man, when I heard about that story that Lizzie almost got killed by a monster, that was so terrifying. When I heard that Lizzie almost died from, like, this monster thing, I could not stop laughing. Before you go and comment, like, oh my gosh, Mia's a monster, she wants people to die. But she's just gonna respawn anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. But man, I really wish I could have seen that, because that is hilarious. Okay, it is almost time to start round number two. But before we do that, it is time for the Wheel of Sabotage! <gasps> yes, let's go. I hope I got the sabotage this time, because I'll wait. Yeah, I hope I got a sabotage so I can sabotage the person that I want to sabotage out. Okay. <laughs> okay, it is time to spin the Wheel of Sabotage! Who is going to get a sabotage where they can, well, um, sabotage another contestant? Okay, it is time to spin the wheel. And the sabotage goes to Noah. Are you serious? It goes to him? Weird what are you what are you weirdos even doing? We're driving around in our new ride. That's such an ugly car. No, it's not. You're saying it's watermelons ugly are ugly. <laughs> Guavas are ugly? You're rude. So, Noah, at any given point in the episode, you can use your sabotage to mess up another contestant. All you have to do is find the contestant, shout sabotage, and state what your sabotage is. For example, no accessories or no shoes, um, only this amount of diamonds, you know? Okay, gather around the fountain to reveal the next theme. Where are you? We're driving around. <laughs> Oh my gosh, what are you doing? You guys are so weird. Can you just come to the fountain so we can please dress up? Like, isn't that the whole point of the show? Okay, it is time to reveal the theme for round number two. So, the next theme is... Childhood costume! Oh, no, 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 no. You know those costumes that you used to pick out when you were little to go trick-or-treating in? Well, you are going to have to base your outfit off of that. Lizzie and Noah, you will have five minutes to create an outfit. Mia, you will have six. And those minutes start now! Okay, so, this one's harder. Um, I was trying to think about what childhood costume I could do. Uh, I know there was this one year that I was a unicorn, but I don't have a unicorn horn, so I think I'm gonna do this one costume that I wore when I was really little. It was, like, supposed to be an LPS, I'm pretty sure. Um, it was, like, a pink cat, so I think I'm gonna be able to replicate that. I remember one of my best costumes, I actually already clicked on the wings, but one of my best outfits was a purple fairy. No fairy exactly, just a purple fairy. 
Okay, so I figured it out I'm gonna be uh, Harry Potter. That's what I was a few years ago. I think I could do like a shorter hairstyle. I'm gonna do this funky little hairdo. And of course I'm gonna make it pink. So I'm, I already have the hair. Um, my hair is brown and messy. Um, actually, here wait. It was shorter and it wasn't curled. <laughs> Even to this day, I still don't really like curling my hair. Because my hair kind of got messed up very easily. That's probably exactly what my hair would look like, but I don't want to own up to it. <laughs> it might be a bit hard. So first, I need to get rid of this. Um, brown hair. Is he a brown? I think he has black hair. Sorry. Yeah, that'll do. Okay. Now, for the outfit. I'm not quite sure what to do. Maybe just something pink. Maybe furry. Because I'm pretty sure the costume was just kind of like a cat costume. Also, um, I feel like I'm definitely going to be sabotaged by Noah. And that could happen at any time. So, uh... Oh, wait. This is kind of cute. It has some white in it, too. But it has this little cat design on it. So that could work. Okay, so I remember... I'm a purple fairy. So I remember wearing a skirt. It was like a dark purple. Oh, this one. Oh, yeah. That looks really great. So first, we need to get those iconic... Glasses, which I don't have circular glasses. I know, that's kind of like the main thing, but that's close enough. I'll go for this, and then what's really going to tie this together is my accessories. So I have two pairs of cat ears. I have these smaller ones, and I have these bigger ones. Um, they don't really work with this hair too well, but I can do these little ones. Make them a cute pastel color. So then... I remember just wearing, like, a t-shirt, kind of. Well, it was, like, long sleeves, so I'll try to- I'll try to find some, uh, sleeves. Okay. Give him a smirk. Uh, I gotta get rid of that scar, though. He has a scar, but not on his eye. Ooh! Really? Yes! Oh my gosh, that's perfect! I didn't even know they had that. And then, of course, get my little tail. And then I think I have paws, too. Yep. Oh, I don't really have any sleeves. Oh yeah, because I gave them to my sister, because I'm a nice child <laughs> most of the time. I feel like I had a wand, but I don't have a wand in real high, so I'm just going to go with this. Oh, two minutes? What the heck? Okay, uh, okay. Then maybe I can get some shoes, then maybe some earrings. You know, this is actually not too hard. As long as nothing goes wrong, you should be good. I don't really, oh yeah, I need shoes. Well, I'm just gonna wear tennis shoes. <laughs> Cause, hmm. Nah, I, I feel like these. Yeah, that's probably what I, that I would have worn as a child. <laughs> Why does this look exactly like my child self? <laughs> well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Oh no! 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 And then maybe I can give myself a little like trick or treating bag. Maybe this little ghost one, or yeah, I'll do the little ghost one. And I had my ears pierced back then, so I can't really add some- Oh, what about this? Yeah, there we go. One minute. Oh my gosh. Oh no, this is not going to be good. It's not going to be good at all. Why are there no normal suits? Uh, I just feel like it doesn't look that complete. <laughs> but I don't want to add too much stuff. So I'm going to try to find a face. This seriously looks just like me when I was four. I'm out of time. I'm almost out of time. What is going on with these outfits? I guess this is good enough. This is the best I can get. Oh gosh. Time is flying by. No, 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 no. You think the bag is like too much? Because, I don't know. Oh gosh, it's bright. I'm gonna make it black. There's black gummy bears somewhere. You know what? I think I might be done. I think this is a really cute outfit. I have 38 seconds left, so there's really nothing else I can do. But uh, yeah, I think I look really cute. Here we go. Oh. I seriously look like my childhood self. What is going on? Oh no. Okay, so the host was very kind and, I, and they were able to give me an extra 25 seconds. Where, come on, where are the suits? They literally have no suit. Maybe undershirts. Let's go look undershirts. Please, please, please. Oh yes, there's something. What? That was not 25 seconds. No way that was 25 seconds. No, that wasn't 25 seconds. That was like five seconds. There are literally no suits. No normal. Oh, right here. Right here! Right here! Right here! Okay, time is up, and now it is time for the contestants to show off their outfits. First up is... Noah! Noah? 
Oh. Hey, wait, why am I in your car? So, what are you wearing today, Noah? Uh, I am wearing some, uh, I'm wearing, I'm, uh, I'm being Harry Potter. Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. That's what I was once. <laughs> um, I couldn't find really any good outfits since there's barely any normal suits in, in, uh, in the catalog. So, uh, the only thing I could find was this. I forgot to get rid of the bow tie, so that's that. Um, uh, I spent a lot of time on the face, but not much time on the outfit. And, uh, yep. Thank you very much, Noah. Now please step off the stage so we can welcome our next contestant. Next up is Lizzie. Oh, excuse me, Noah, please don't do that. So, what are you wearing, um, Lizzie? Okay, when I was, like, four, I think, I dressed up as a purple fairy. Not, not like, a fairy from, like, a show or something, just a purple fairy. <laughs> so, I have the, like, wings, and then I have, uh, you can't really see it, but I have, like, the one, and then, um, un and then underneath the, um, one in the bag and stuff, you can kind of see my, um, purple dress. Um, and then my purple shoes, and then you have my messy hair, and my messy bangs, because I had really messy hair back then. <laughs> Thank you very much, Lizzie. Uh, please step off the stage so, um, our next contestant can come out. Last but not least is Mia! Get me out of your car, uh, uh, Excuse me! Can you please stop trying to sabotage me? Hi, so this is my outfit. Um, this is based on an outfit that I wore when, um, I'm actually not quite sure how old I was, but it was a long time ago. It was a Littlest Pet Shop cat, and it was a pink cat. This is more kind of based on the outfit, and it isn't an exact, like, replica of it. It's just kind of inspired. But yeah, I have these cute little pigtails. I have this little kitty outfit. I have my kitty paws, my kitty ears, my kitty tail, and uh, yeah, I also paired it with this little ghost trick-or-treating bag. So, uh, yeah. Thank you very much, Mia. Now everyone stand um, on the, not really on the stage, just near the fountain. <laughs> Noah, please. Enough with the car. I regret giving you guys cars. Okay, now it's time for the viewers to cast their votes. You can go in the pinned comment uh, below. And vote for who you think won round number two. Will it be Mia with her cute kitty outfit? Will it be Lizzie with her pretty purple fairy? Or will it be Noah with his stylish Harry Potter? Again, please vote based on the outfit and not by anything else so we can have a nice fair game. Okay, now it is time for round number three. The theme for round number three is... Nightmare! Ooh, spooky. So, Lizzie and Noah, once again, you will have five minutes to create an outfit. Mia, you will have six. And, uh, your time starts now. You're gonna sabotage me right now? <gasps> okay, fine, spit it out. Okay, so I got some information, a little thing, some stuff. What yeah. are you talking about? Um, Just spit it out. So, your challenge is... You have to wear- you have to use neon colors for the entire outfit. <gasps> really? Yup. <laughs> and that credit goes to Lizzie. She gave me that great idea. What? Are you guys privately chatting? That's not fair. <laughs> hey, that's the- that's the reason we have alliances. Ugh, whatever. You know, I, I'm still gonna win. Even if I have to use neon colors. So. That means no black. No. Yes, I no know. Whites. I know what neon means. <laughs> Neon black. <laughs> Neon black. Okay, uh... So, I kinda knew I was gonna get sabotaged because my fellow contestants don't have more than, like, two brain cells, and they'll just sabotage anyone that hurts their ego. But, you know, they can, they can sabotage me all they want, but it won't stop me from slaying. The reason I decided to sabotage Mia is just because, well, it's not because she's strong competition, because, well, she certainly isn't. It's just because, well... She's been kind of mean to all of us, so I decided to, uh, sabotage her. So, yeah, the sabotage was kind of my idea, but I, I was just thinking, night don't really include neon colors, and when he chose, uh, when Noah chose my sabotage as his sabotage, I felt so honored. Okay, so, the theme is Nightmare, and I sabotaged Mia, and... Thanks to Lizzie for giving me the great suggestion that for only using neon colors, that's gonna be really hard to act to make an out a decent outfit with that. But 
That's what her challenge, not mine. Okay, so nightmare. Now this would normally be pretty easy. However, I have to use neon colors. But the thing is, dreams are normally pretty weird anyway. So I wouldn't be surprised if people's nightmares had um neon creatures. We're back. Third round. So for this one, worst nightmare. I don't really know what I want to do. Uh, I might kind of aim for my Halloween costume on Raw High. So I like these wings. Um, I'm not gonna wear them quite yet because I don't want it to be too distracting because I get really easily distracted. Kind of, I kind of want to be like creepy, like something from the shadows. You know what I mean. So I think I'm gonna go for like kind of a weird creepy, you know, something that could only exist in your dreams. So I think I'll do this um messy hairdo. Now, maybe green. You know what? Maybe the sabotage is good. It might make me stand out. I'll do this. Oh, wait. I can probably make it glow. Yeah, there we go. For my worst nightmare, I'm pretty sure like an ox. I don't know. Because it, sometimes they just kind of scare me. Yeah, I just feel like sometimes they're kind of just like sus. So. That, but obviously not that face. Maybe something that's just like staring into your soul. That's kind of good. Yeah. <laughs> Good. Now for the outfit, hmm, I need something really weird looking. Maybe this really skinny corset? That could work. Okay, so I don't really know what else I want to wear. <laughs> I've worn so many masks. Oh, that looks so creepy. Sorry, I'm being quiet. I'm just looking for a good hair color. No, uh, I might just go for solid black. There's some color, I might just do that. There's some color. Now, should I do a skirt? Maybe this? Now, I really need a spooky face, but that is- oh my gosh. <laughs> um, that is still, like, brightly colored. What did I just click on? Oh my gosh, so creepy. Oh, that's, that's scaring me. <laughs> this might be a very boring outfit. I'm just- I might just go for all black. Don't worry, I'm gonna add more stuff to it so it's not just all black. To be fair, there really aren't that many neon faces, so uh, if I don't do a neon face, I can just say that there aren't any neon faces, which there aren't. Okay, so there aren't really any neon faces, so I think I'm just gonna do something spooky. Ooh, that's creepy. Okay, okay. Okay, so, I don't know. This just says something. Um, <laughs> might just go for this again. This is a very bland outfit. I don't know how I feel about it. I was liking it. Now it's too black. Maybe some heels. Might do these, actually. Now, let's do a knife. That sounds weird, but uh, it can be a bright red. There we go. Okay, so I might go with this. It's kind of scary, though. I mean, <laughs> that's, that's kind of what I'm going for. Now, what else? What else? What else? How about I make this creepier? To be fair, those are ready to look something that would come out of my nightmares. One minute! Ugh. I don't know what that sound was. <laughs> I might do these winter wings. I'm just going for, like, a weird evil, you know? Because I don't really have any other choice because I have to use neon colors. Ooh, a cloak or nah, the black. Oh, yeah, that gives away. There we go. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna do these like mermaid ears, although you can't really see them, but they're there. I actually gotta layer a few ears. Maybe some of these. Why is this actually kind of scary? Oh, time's up. All right, I'm out of time. This is not my favorite outfit, but hey, it's fine. Okay, time is up, so it is time for the contestants to show off their outfits. First up is Noah! Oh, back at it with the car. So, explain your outfit to us, Noah. So, my, my idea was that I didn't want to go for, like, some creepy thing. I mean, I did go for a creepy thing. But, like, I didn't want to be, like, you can actually see me. I was trying to go for, like, a shadow monster. Very, very, th there's not much going on. <laughs> it's basically all just darkness. But, uh, I don't know. Thank you very much, Noah. Please step off the stage. Next up is Lizzie. <laughs> Hello, explain your outfit to Lizzie. Yeah, so, I don't know. Like, the ox horns, they just kind of looked scary, I guess, with my outfit, so. And then the knife. Um, don't worry, it's only ketchup, but, um, still kind of scary. I just mainly went for black, and if you look really closely, there are spiders all over my face. Okay, yeah. thank you very much, Lizzie. Very spooky. Now, last but certainly not least, is Mia! Hey, everybody! So, um, I was sabotaged, which means I- 
Excuse me, can you please leave? You can't sabotage me again, you already used your sabotage. So, I was sabotaged and I was only able to use neon colors, but I think this actually helped me because it made me stand out and I didn't look like the rest of them. Now, I don't know about you, but my dreams and my nightmares are very weird, so I think the neon colors actually very, um, fit very well. So I went for this crazy hair and these really big wings and this outfit. And there weren't any neon faces, so I just went with this scary black, um, eyes. And I also have a, my, um, bloody knife, but the blood is still neon, so it still fits. And, um, yeah, I think I did pretty well considering I was, uh, sabotaged, so yeah. Thank you very much, Mia. Now it is time for the viewers to cast their votes, so you can go in the pinned comment below and vote for who you think won in round number three. Is it Mia's neon monster? Is it Lizzie's dark, scary outfit? Or <laughs> is it Noah's shadowy being? So yeah, that is it for this episode of Fashion Wars. Well, um, good luck, guys. You're definitely gonna need it. Vote for me and you get a free taco. Now you're just scamming people. That's not cool. Well, no. Once I win that winning money, then I can buy all the free tacos I want. Yep. Sure. Anyway, um, good luck because you guys are definitely gonna need it. So is you. Yeah, um, well, I won this time. I mean, I won last time, and I'm definitely gonna win this time, so. You guys can go do whatever losers do with each other, and um, I'm gonna go relax, so you guys have fun doing that. Um, yeah. If Hi. you vote for Mia, you have to eat a bottle of worms. Uh, just a disclaimer, there are no consequences for voting for people, so, uh, yeah. I think, um, the host is on Mia's side, because yeah. he keeps saying, like, a whole bunch of things that, like, he keeps compliment yeah. Mia and stuff. Like, and last but certainly, certainly not least. I would say that for anybody, she just happens to be the last one to come out. And, uh, also, I am obligated to stay neutral on this show or else I would get sued, so I'm definitely not favoriting anybody. And I just wanted people I'm to know that you don't have to actually eat worms for voting for anybody. I'm suing this show. Yeah, you do that, and uh, that's not gonna work. Says who? Says my lawyers. Anyway, I'm just gonna pan away from them. Um, that is it for this episode of Fashion Wars. Make sure to vote for who you think won each round in the pinned comment below. Make sure to stay tuned for another episode. Um, the crew really enjoys making these, so uh, we'll definitely be doing more. I have fun making it when Mia isn't here. Okay. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to Puppy Girl for more. Subscribe to Kyla Luke. No, <laughs> I'm just kidding, you can't. I'm joking, you probably shouldn't because my videos are very cringy. Make sure to follow Puppy Girl on these social medias that are on the screen right now. They will be linked in the description. And uh, again, just a quick disclaimer that this is all fake and it's just for fun. So uh, don't go hating on everybody for like causing drama because that's the point of the show. If we hated each other, we wouldn't film this. Yeah. <laughs> so wow. yeah. Um, Make sure to vote for me to get a free taco. Yep. <laughs> and vote for me. You get if you vote for me, you get a free pizza. No food actually promised. Uh, so yeah, I will see you guys next time. Goodbye! Bye! Bye. Goodbye! Outfit swall? Big rip. Oh, what are you oh. about? Help. Hey, what is this? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Let's just do witch because Aww. that's more basic. Aww. We'll do that afterwards. Aww. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Wait, what else was that? Oh my gosh. So I was like an optional. <laughs> no, you should not call Principal Frost. I'm not putting this in the video. It will make no sense. Wait, no, I did the wrong principal. Why did I do that? Because remember, the principal, the principal is your pal. <laughs> Change back to your other My principal's gonna be watching this and like get me stoned for saying principals are not pals. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see that? See what? Your car just backed up on its own. Uh, that's creepy. <laughs> oh, see, look! Look! Uh, that's actually kind of really scary. <laughs> it's moving! <laughs> it's a ghost.
<laughs> oh, your your car did it again. While you, Wait, that's actually kind of creepy. While you were gone, no, the car kept moving. I'm making a car. No, I'm making I'm a car. I'm making a car. There you go. Here's my car. No, I get Carrots. in the car. Carrots. Carrots. <laughs> Carrots. <laughs> Why? Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> what are you doing? Wait, hold on. Let me make a car better. Noah, please. I'm gonna make a watermelon. Or a that. Noah. <laughs> this one's more Halloweeny though. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> Noah, please. Oh no! What happened to your car? <laughs> what is that? I, I wrecked it. Oops, my bad. Oh no! Oh no, what's going on? No, you're pushing my car back. Ah. No! <laughs> ah, what happened? <laughs> Get in the car, please. Please! I choose my own car. Yeah, me too. You have um, the carriage, we have the lemon. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Okay, I I'm ditching the car thing. These are too hard no, to no, control. No, no, no. Hop in the lemon. Hop in the lemon. The lemon's not going to be any <laughs> easier to control. Lemon. Hop in the lemon. <laughs> You're <laughs> driving <laughs> away. <laughs> you. it doesn't deserve to be the car. Wow, look at this place. It's so. <laughs> oh. Okay, I think we got it. Okay, 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 okay. Wait. No, 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 you ruined no, it. Lemon. <laughs> the lemon. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> No. No, 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 the lemon. Trust, believe in the lemon. Believe I don't believe in the believe lemon. I never did. Believe in the lemon. If you don't believe in the lemon, you don't believe in you. <laughs> I'm not the lemon, though. Ah! Oh, no. I'm, okay, I'm done with this lemon. I'm lemon, done. No, let the lemon. I'm let done. The lemon. 